Hey guys, we are back for another video. I just got done doing a video on how to choose your YouTube handle. It's a great video. Make sure that you check it out because YouTube is sending us messages about a YouTube handle. And I wanted to make sure that you guys were in the know and jumped on it immediately. So once I do that video, then it's time for me to pick a thumbnail or select a thumbnail. And sometimes YouTube gives me three different options and I don't like the option. So I have to create my own graphic thumbnail. And I'm going to show you how I do that and how I upload it. And I, I want to show you that because I use this very specific uh, app. I know people do it different ways, but this is the way that works for me. I have this whole process that I follow from the recording of the video to how to edit it. The video is involved. It's very like succinct and it works for me. But I want to show you this one piece of the puzzle that I think may be beneficial for you. I use Canva to do my graphics and we'll talk about another video later about what you do to do that. So here's my graphic. I already had, of course, we have hundreds and thousands of pictures in our phone and I already had a picture. So I picked this graphic. I chose the font because it was a different font, you know, centered it, all that good stuff, how to put the picture on there, remove the background. Canva allows you to do all of that, not with the free version. You have to get the premium version, and so I have that. And then you're able to download this to your phone. This is my process. So this is the download button. I hit the download, and then now it's on my phone. So I scroll up out of the Canva app, and I go over to the YT Studio. That's the YouTube Studio. So I go over to the YouTube Studio app, and here you can see my dashboard again, because you're going to see it in the other video. You'll see my name, how many subscribers, all of my channel analytics. So this is why, in addition to putting your thumbnail up, this app helps me see the stuff in the background that's going on that you're easily able to see. You can see it on your YouTube page, but I like to see it on my app too. We're always moving around. So you see my watch time, all that good stuff, all the videos, my latest comments. That's all on my dashboard. I have content. Those are my videos. You have analytics. It gives you all of that good stuff like my top videos. Uh, you see the little analytics here. These are my top videos. Pretty cool, right? And my comments. There's more comments. And then monetization. And we'll leave that alone. So we'll go back over to the dashboard. And you'll see also last 28 days, but I'm going to go over to content. So this is the video, how to select a YouTube channel handle. That is my latest video that will go up. And I am going to show you how to put this graphic in that video. It's already there because of course we had to record this a couple times. So we'll show you again, but you hit the pencil here. And then you'll have like whatever YouTube picks as a picture. So this is all of my stuff that, as I said earlier, is done on the computer. The date it was uploaded, the description, playlists, I added it to two playlists, uh, my tags, all of that good stuff was already done on the computer. So you hit this little uh, square here. And these are the pictures that YouTube picked for me. And that's what I mean. I didn't like those pictures because this is my intro. This is my outro. And this was actually some of the video. So we needed a better thumbnail, a better picture, better graphic. So we, this will be here and I can hit change, right? And it'll open up to my pictures. We hit that again. You can also download this, but we're fine. We want to pick select, we want to hit save, and then now that is the thumbnail for our video. So I want to show you, you always refresh it and then you can see the thumbnail, but I want to show you if we go over to the YouTube app. So we're going to go to the YouTube app. I'll show you um, here is my page my channel oh i didn't mean to do that i don't even know what i did i turned off incognito i don't want that all right i'm back <laughs> all right let's go to our channel you'll see videos and here is our updated video 
how to select a YouTube channel handle that works for you. That's the picture. It's upcoming, so it hasn't uh, been released yet, but you'll see it in our next couple of videos. And we just wanted to shoot this video to show you how we put that picture in there. Hopefully this helps you. Let us know. Make sure that you like, comment, subscribe, and share. It'll be greatly appreciated. Leave us some comments. Let us know your process or if this helps you. If you're growing your YouTube page and, you know, it takes a couple nuances to get used to your rhythm and how you do things. But we finally figured out a process that completely works for us. And you, YT Studio is a part of that. Again, you guys have an amazing day. Be blessed and talk to you soon. Take care.